Hello, people. You hear that music? It's Tchaikovsky's music, so there won't be a copyright claim in this video. This is my 50th video, and I'm going to show my uh, VHS collection. Uh, most of the VHSs I collected over the years. I still got. I'm going to start with this one. Got a movie called The Contract. Wait. It's with an uh, actress named uh, Joanna Black. She's from Canada. Pretty decent movie. I liked it. Here's a wrestling uh, DVD. I hope you can hear me. It's, uh, I mean, VHS uh, Rebellion from 2001. Never before seen in the U.S. because it was a U.K. pay-per-view from November 3rd of 2001. Here's uh, Survivor Series 2001. Definitely one of the best Survivor Series I've seen. I love the main event. It was pretty cool. I want to just hear some music so that I have some background music while I think. And this is public domain, so I could put as much of it as I want. Here's another awesome movie. Fortress. I, I like this movie. I thought it was really awesome. Christopher Lambert's really good in this movie. Uh, really good effects. Really good action. Definitely a winner. The sequel, eh, it's not that bad. It's tolerable. The remake of Godzilla. Yes, I do like this movie. I, I like the box. It's uh, pretty cool. I like uh, this movie. Yeah, Godzilla's not the best in this movie. It says it's big, it's fun, it's loud. Yeah, I agree. I like this as a remake. I like Jean Reno in the movie. I like uh, um, the the effects for the most part. I like the action. And it's a fun movie, you know. It's a guilty pleasure, definitely. Godzilla remake. Here's uh, the uncut version of Bride of the Reanimator. I enjoyed this. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. <laughs> yeah, this is a, a Beetlejuice, uh, the VHS, because the DVD has no features. And it says an uproar, uproarous ghost comedy. There hasn't been anything like this since Ghostbusters. Yeah, very imaginative film. I love this film. Hold on. Let me get this out of the way. There we go. Yeah. I'm glad you go get to see this. Here's another movie I got. Deathmatch. Pretty decent. I mean, it was all right. There's uh, no no nudity there. No, there's no nudity there. Just checking. Uh, pretty decent 90s film. There's uh, The Mutilator. Yes, I have it on VHS. Not the worst slasher I've ever seen. It wasn't that boring. I mean, you know, it has its moments. Here's another a wrestling video HS of Stone Cold Steve Austin, Demolition. It's basically 30 minutes of clips from some of his uh, matches and stuff like that from the late 90s. Good stuff. This is a gem that uh, Rambo Ref got back in 2011. You already see it. The original Star Wars trilogy on VHS. Every, every Star Wars fan should have this, because it's all uncut, the, the uh, theatrical editions of Star Wars, A New Hope. That music is tremendous, I love that music. It's my favorite music, classical music is the best. Here's Empire Strikes Back. My favorite of all time, Return of the Jedi. Greatest movie of all time to me. I saw this as a kid, I still love it as an adult. It's the best one to me. The Ewoks don't bother me, they're completely adorable. And I love the, the movie, just my favorite movie of all time. I could have this on anything, any format, and I just love it to death. Mwah. Love this movie. Here's the uh, special edition trilogy, yeah. It's got different covers. There's the gold thing. Is it still in mid condition? Here's uh, the cover of A New Hope. There's a special edition of Empire. A 
already five minutes. Here's Return of the Jedi. There we go. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> That's just a box here. I love both trilogies. Even though with the CGI, it didn't bother me. I know Rambo Ref doesn't care for it. It's fine. It's cool. I still, you know, respect the guy. And I'm glad that, uh, you know, he has the original trilogy on VHS. It's the only version that on, you know, on the format that's uh, completely with the theatrical cut with, you know, digitally remastered. Because the DVD version doesn't have it. Okay, I'm going to cut here and do another part, so I'll see you in a little while.